here, you check your temperature, mm -hmm. uh, and you get a daily excess fan. Every day it changes. It has date stamp and the color. If you don't have this, you can't be here. Gotcha. You shouldn't be here. And then, they will check your temperature. What's up guys, I'm outside the Mohegan Sun Arena in Uncasville, Connecticut where the Bellator offices are set up. Uh, momentarily, I'm going to be taking a tour inside the facility to see what kind of protocols Bellator has put in place. Running shows again in the pandemic. They'll be back at Bellator 242 on Friday, but before that I'm going to go check out the arena. The fighter will walk from the locker room out to uh, the stage, which will be right here. These backdrops will be here, which I'm told will present some interesting lighting for the fights. Uh, there'll be screens, as you can see, and then a cage. They'll go fight, do their thing inside the cage. Then when it's all over, it's all said and done. See the, uh, the stadium seating all rolled up. Once they're done, the winners will do their post-fight interview right here with Jen Brown. The losers will be escorted out here to do their medicals. And the both teams' bags will be brought out by a member of the staff, they'll have packed up all their things while they're out in the fight. And they'll have them ready to go around the corner over here. Or actually, they'll have them in the hotel room, I think, is what I was told. So then, the fighters will walk down here. They'll have their medicals done somewhere along here. And then once they're ready to go back, they'll be escorted up the escalator where they'll get fill out their final paperwork, payment forms, etc. And they'll be able to exit their arena back to the, um, the fighter hotel, which is in Mohegan Sun. And yeah. <laughs>